Hello, uh, good afternoon. Um, how are you doing? My name is Brent Deicher. I am the Director of Curriculum and Program Development at Snipes Farm and Education Center. And I want to tell you a little bit about why I like winter. And um, I like all the seasons. And I like to say that my favorite season is the season I'm in. Um, because we're lucky to live in an area like Pennsylvania, New Jersey, where I live, that the mid-Atlantic states have four seasons. So not everywhere in the world has four seasons. So I really appreciate the beauty and the teachings of each season. As we think of nature as a teacher, the seasons can be our teacher. And for winter, I really think of winter as a time to, to slow down and to be introspective. At the same time, it's also a great time to be outside. Uh, winter, uh, obviously you have snow in the winter time sometimes, uh, and that allows for a lot of opportunities for tracking and snow shelter building and, and just the serenity and peacefulness of, of snow. Uh, but we also have um, a, a time where you can look out at kind of the trees and they kind of look like, like skeletons. They don't have the leaves on them. So they, they have a different beauty to them. There's a lot of beauty in winter time. And I like to appreciate that beauty. And um, I'm not really worried about the cold because as I've said before, there's no such thing as poor weather, only poor preparation for weather. So as long as you layer up and, and are prepared for the weather, then that'll keep your, your, your body heat trapped inside. That's really why you want layers, to, to act as an insulator for your, the, the warmth that your body is producing, okay? So another thing that's really great about winter is that what I'm going to do at the LEAF program at Snipes Farm Education Center is maple syrup, okay? Making maple syrup, maple sugary. Is that cool or what? We're going to tap some maple trees this February for our class called Farm Life in Winter. So the question is, what do, what do farmers or what have farmers done in the past in farming, uh, children of farmers, of farming families? What have they done in the past during winter? So there are different tasks related to the seasons. And one of those great things around here, okay, is maple syrup making, maple sugary. Um, so maple trees, okay, this is a sugar maple tree, only grow in the mid-Atlantic and up on to Canada. This is the only place in the world that we have sugar maple trees. So not only do we have four seasons, we're lucky to have four seasons, but we also are lucky to have maple, sugar maple trees, um, because that we can make maple syrup from them, okay? So we're going to get that going, uh, and we'll teach you how to make maple syrup and the process in all the way back from Native Americans to colonists to the current day. So we're going to talk about maple syrup and, and the science behind it and using a little math because there's a little math involved in figuring out how much sap it takes to, to make a little bit of syrup. It's a, it's a big ratio, okay? Um, so we're going to learn all of those great things in the class called Farm Life in Winter. So. Um, that's all I have for today. And again, get outside um, in, in, in any time of weather, in any type of season, any type of weather. It's just great to be outside in fresh air, soaking in the sunshine. If it is sunny like it is today, um, it's just great to be outside in all types of weather. So thank you very much. That's it for now.